Howdy there, folks. I'm Quinn of Snazzy Labs, and, well, it looks like you've forgotten your password. Don't worry, it happens to the best of us. Not me, but maybe you. But this video has been made to help you reestablish and reset your password without losing any of your files, any of your data, etc. This works on any Mac, so please make sure it's yours and not one of your friends or your parents, or you will be getting access to their private information. I'm watching you. Let's get started. This trick requires Macintosh OS 10.6 or above. So Lion Mountain, Lion Mavericks, and the new Yosemite will work. If you're using Leopard or Snow Leopard, I have a video in the description below to help you with your older Mac. After ensuring that your computer is fully turned off, you may turn it back on using the power button. Directly after pressing the power button, you need to press the command plus the R key on your keyboard to enter recovery mode. Keep that held until you hear the startup sound. You'll find yourself in a place that looks like this. This is recovery mode. That being said, we won't be using any of the tools that are available in the GUI. So from your menu bar, we need to enter the terminal app, which is under the utilities tab. From this window, you'll need to enter the phrase reset password, all one word, then press the return key. This is the window where the magic happens. We are notified to select a volume. We need to select the boot drive of the Macintosh operating system, which is almost always entitled Macintosh HD. Then you need to select the user account for which the password needs to be reset. Then enter a new password and an optional password hint, which I would recommend seeing as though you forgot yours. That's why you're watching this video. Now, alongside our pictures and documents is something that's called a keychain. When you go to a website and Safari does its autofill, it's reading or scraping information from a keychain. Since we have forgotten our original password, it's telling us that the keychain is not going to function. All of the passwords will be forgotten for our own security. And so there's really no way to get around that. You will now need to restart your device. And once we get back to the login screen, voila, we're set. We just have to enter the new password and we are ready to go. Now, if you don't remember your old password, which I assume you don't, you will need to start and create a new keychain. Well, that's all for me. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please subscribe, rate, and comment. And as always, stay snazzy. See you later, folks.